10, Thursday, September 10th. Today is um, winter and raining and warm. Today's lunch choice is corn dog nuggets. Now to Dr. Sherrod's for morning meeting. Good morning, everybody, and happy Thursday. Today, you're going to get the opportunity to hear from our amazing counselor, Mr. Haley, and he has some wonderful words of wisdom to share. So enjoy the time listening to Mr. Haley. Ah, ah, I am so angry, man. I am so angry, man. I cannot get into my coconut. I don't know what is wrong. I am so, so angry, man. Ah. What did the mind yeti tell me, man? He told me to breathe, breathe, and calm down. I shall try to breathe, man. Breathe. I'm going to put the coconut down, man. The coconut, I'm getting angry at a coconut, and that's just silly, man. So I think I'm going to set it down and try to practice what the mind yeti, the mind yeti taught us last week, man, on our thoughtful Thursday. Let's just set this to the side. Big breath in and a nice long breath out. Everybody share with me, man. A big breath in and a nice long breath out. Quit thinking about that coconut, man. It's an island disaster, I tell you. I cannot get into the coconut. Maybe somebody put the lime in the coconut. I don't know, man. But getting mad at the coconut, that's not going to help. But I can breathe. In, everybody practice together. Out, in, out. Oh, I'm feeling so much better, man. I'm not going to worry. Not going to worry about the thing I tell you. Everything is going to be all right. Now that I listen to the mind yeti and calm down, my whole body, I can feel my body feeling better. Ah, so much better, man. That has been very helpful. Well, I hope we were able to learn something from our Rastafarian friend from the islands. What did he teach us today? Well, one thing he taught us is a little bit silly to get, get upset with a coconut just because you can't open a coconut. It's kind of like math or reading. Sometimes we get really, really frustrated and you can feel it all in your body. You can feel all that emotion and anxiety, which means you just feel really like Ugh, all in knots. But by practicing our breathing or moving away from the problem, our Rastafarian friend, he set the coconut off to one side and he didn't even mess with it anymore. And then he breathed, he takes several deep breaths to try to relax. Now let's see what happens when we're a little bit more relaxed. Maybe we should get that coconut back out. Mmm, here's our coconut once again. And our Rastafarian friend was having so much trouble, but he taught me a very special trick from the islands themselves. A great Rastafarian trick. Oh, hang on, hang on, let's see if I can get it without getting angry at it. <clears throat> ah, there, there's no need to get angry. It's just a coconut. I hope you all had a wonderful, thoughtful Thursday. And remember, when problems really, really bother you, Anger is really not a good solution. You can try deep breathing, walking away, setting it to the side, and coming back at a different time. Thanks. Have a great day. And thanks again for joining us for Thoughtful Thursday. And now for our mission statement. And I have some people in the audience in our green screen room that's going to help me. Ready? JPS Kids Soar Higher. Super problem solvers, outstanding writers, accomplished readers, ready for success. And now our success equation. Ready? And they're going to help me with this today, too. Hard work plus resiliency plus teamwork equals success. Thank you. Have a good day. 
And now it's time for our end of the morning meeting dancing. Here we go. And here I have some friends helping me. Ready? Let's dance. <laughs>